Taking care of our health is super important these days, and knowing how important our liver is for our health is key. We often forget about it, but the liver is really important for keeping us feeling good and energetic. In our video, we're going to show you some cool ways to keep your liver healthy. It's like taking care of yourself, because when your liver is happy, you feel great too. The liver is like a super efficient factory in our body, doing more than 500 important jobs. It helps with digestion, cleans out bad stuff from our body, keeps our cholesterol in check, breaks down hormones, and makes sure our body uses nutrients right. It's like a quiet superhero inside us, making sure everything works as it should. This incredibly important organ is responsible for a lot of critical functions that help us stay well. But unfortunately, it's facing a lot of dangers, mostly because of the lifestyle choices we make and the environment around us. This is especially true in the United States, where the situation is quite alarming. Liver problems, like acute liver failure, are causing around 50,000 deaths every year in the U.S. alone. When we look at the situation worldwide, it's even more shocking. Globally, liver-related issues are leading to a staggering 2 million deaths every year. This really makes us think, why is the liver, such a vital organ, suffering so much harm? The answer seems to lie in the small choices and habits we engage in every day. Our diets, exercise routines, exposure to pollutants, and other daily decisions are playing a big part in the health of our liver. It's a reminder of how important it is to take care of our bodies, not just for the liver, but for our overall health. One of the most well-recognized factors leading to liver damage is the consumption of alcohol. Usually, alcohol was considered the foremost cause of liver-related health issues, and even today, it continues to pose a significant risk. When alcohol is drunk in excessive amounts, it can cause a variety of liver conditions such as fatty liver disease, alcoholic hepatitis, and cirrhosis, a serious condition where normal liver tissue is replaced by scar tissue. These conditions develop as a result of the liver's inability to process and break down alcohol efficiently, leading to inflammation, scaring, and ultimately, impaired liver function. It is important to understand that the damage caused by alcohol to the liver is often progressive and can worsen over time with continued abuse. The key to prevention lies in moderation. By consciously reducing the intake of alcohol, individuals can significantly lower their risk of developing liver problems. This reduction not only helps in preventing new liver issues, but can also aid in mitigating the progression of existing liver damage. Therefore, it's crucial to be mindful of alcohol consumption and to adopt healthier drinking habits for the sake of liver health. The critical role of diet in maintaining liver health cannot be overstated, particularly when it comes to our sugar consumption. High intake of fructose, a type of sugar predominantly found in processed sugars and syrups, exerts a significant strain on our liver. This is because fructose is metabolized in a distinct manner compared to other carbohydrates like those obtained from staples like rice or bread. When we consume fructose in large quantities, it becomes a formidable challenge for our liver, which has to work overtime to process it. This overburden can lead to a host of liver-related health issues. In contrast, other forms of carbohydrates are processed more straightforwardly by the body, posing less of a threat to liver health. What sets fructose apart 
and makes it particularly worrisome is its omnipresence in modern diets, primarily due to the widespread use of high fructose corn syrup in a plethora of processed foods and beverages. This excessive consumption pattern is a major contributor to the escalating rates of liver diseases. However, there is a silver lining. By consciously reducing our intake of sugars, especially those derived from processed sources, we can take a significant step towards safeguarding our liver health. This simple dietary adjustment can have profound implications for our overall well-being, reinforcing the liver's ability to function efficiently and staving off potential health complications. Therefore, being mindful of our sugar consumption is not just a dietary choice, but a crucial aspect of maintaining optimal liver health and overall wellness. Processed omega-6 seed oils, a staple in many household kitchens, are increasingly raising health concerns among nutrition experts. Common varieties such as corn oil, soybean oil, and safflower oil which are often used for cooking and in processed foods, have been linked to adverse health effects when consumed excessively. The primary issue with these oils is their potential to cause inflammation within the body. This inflammation is particularly concerning for the liver, an organ crucial for detoxification and metabolism. When the liver is constantly exposed to inflammatory agents, it can lead to a cascade of health problems, including various liver diseases that can compromise its vital functions. To safeguard liver health and overall well-being, it is advisable to reduce the intake of these processed omega-6 seed oils. Instead, incorporating healthier fats into your diet, such as those found in olive oil, avocados, and nuts, can be a beneficial alternative. These healthier fats not only help in reducing inflammation, but also provide essential nutrients that support the liver and other bodily functions. By making this switch, individuals can enjoy a diverse range of culinary flavors while nurturing their liver health and reducing the risk of related diseases. This approach to dietary fats represents a proactive step towards a healthier lifestyle with benefits extending beyond liver health to encompass overall wellness. Smoking is often thought of as just a lung problem, but it's much more than that. It can really hurt your liver. When you smoke, the amount of oxygen that gets to your body's cells drops. This is bad news for your liver because it needs oxygen to work right. Without enough oxygen, the liver struggles to do its job, which includes cleaning your blood and helping to digest food. But here's a bit of good news. If you decide to quit smoking, you're not just helping your lungs, you're also giving your liver a chance to heal and work better. And that's not all. Quitting smoking can make a big difference in other areas of your health, too. You might notice you're breathing easier, have more energy, and even feel less stressed. Kicking the smoking habit is like giving a gift to your entire body, especially your liver. It's a tough challenge, but it's definitely worth it for your health and well-being. Drug abuse is a big problem for the liver our body's important organ. This includes not only illegal drugs, but also common medicines that you can buy without a doctor's prescription. For example, many everyday drugs like Tylenol, NyQuil, and DayQuil have a substance called acetaminophen in them. This ingredient, although helpful, can be very harmful to the liver if we take too much of it or use it the wrong way. These drugs are easy to find and buy, which makes it tempting to use them without thinking much about it. 
but it's really important to be careful with these medicines. We should only use them when necessary and always follow the instructions on how to take them. By doing this, we can help keep our liver safe and avoid serious health problems. Knowing about body burden is really important when it comes to keeping your liver healthy. Think of your liver like a hard-working machine. It has to deal with a lot of things that can make it tired or stressed. This includes stuff our bodies naturally make, like waste from metabolism and hormones. But it's not just that. Things from outside our bodies, like pollutants in the environment, the food we eat, whether we smoke or drink, and even the medicines we take, all add to the liver's workload. Your liver can handle a certain amount of this burden and still work well. But imagine if you keep piling up more and more on it. At some point, it's going to be too much, right? That's what happens with the liver. When all these factors become too much, the liver can't keep up. It's like overloading a truck. It can't drive properly anymore. This overload can start to damage the liver. So understanding and managing this body burden is key to keeping our liver in good shape. Everybody's liver health is different because of things like how old we are, what genes we have, and any health problems we might already have. These things can change how our liver deals with stress. For example, older people or those with certain genes might find their liver gets stressed more easily, which could lead to liver problems. But here's some good news. Our liver is pretty amazing at fixing itself. It has a special power to heal from harm, as long as it's not constantly under stress. This means that even if a lot of the liver cells are hurt, the liver can often get better by itself over time. This is especially true if we take care of the reasons why the liver got hurt in the first place. To keep your liver healthy, making some changes to your daily life is really important. Think about eating a well-rounded diet that includes plenty of fruits, veggies, grains, and lean meats. These foods give your body what it needs without putting too much pressure on your liver. Also, getting regular exercise helps your liver a lot. It boosts how your body uses energy and lowers the chance of getting overweight or having type 2 diabetes, both of which can make your liver work too hard. It's also super important to be careful with medicines, even the ones you can buy without a prescription. Knowing what's in them and how they might affect your liver is key to avoiding accidental harm. Plus, try to stay away from environmental toxins as much as you can, as these can also add extra strain on your liver. In the journey to a healthier liver, every choice counts. From the foods we eat to the substances we avoid, our daily decisions can significantly impact our liver's health. By understanding the factors that affect liver health and making informed choices, we can not only support our liver, but also enhance our overall well-being. Remember, a healthy liver means a healthier you. Let's embrace these changes and champion our health for a brighter, more vibrant future. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and share it with your friends. Your support helps us create more content like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.